All right, everybody, thank you for tuning in today. Today, I got inspired by a straw that I saw on an Instagram ad. A event that a brand I really like called Belladon LA had, and I just kind of went with it. My cousin sent me a Michelada picture too, and it was just all, it just all went together. So I stenciled out kind of the word cabrona because that was just something I'd been seeing, seeing a lot of with the Belladonna stuff. And I seen that straw that had, I think it had some little girl's name on it, like Emma. It was like a website you could buy curly straws. So I came in with some dotting techniques for the stands. I got this technique from my friend Ernie. And I just kind of went in. I decided to change the color of the Miche on the top. I had just kind of had a clear color. Now I got that tamarind color. And I come in and I start doing the lemon. And it was happening really nice. There were some things I was changing and hating along the way. Like I did not like how I set up that candy at first. So I had to adjust that. You know what I mean? Hands are so difficult, but I'm working on them. Okay, so I didn't film it for whatever reason, but I've done a few adjustments on the painting. I finished the background with all the stadium stuff. This idea I have to give credit to the dots in the stadium. I got that from my friend Ernie because he does a lot of um, sports and like athlete paintings. And in the background, there's always stadiums. And I was looking at my painting like, oh shit, what am I going to do? And I was like, oh shit, I'll do some dots like Ernie does. Like he does different color dots. So I did that. But anyways, I added the tamarindo candy little straw that comes with micheladas I changed the chamoy color because before it was just like clear glass almost with like some dots on it I didn't like how it looked I changed that I did the lemon but I realized right here I don't like that part I think I might bring the candy down a little bit further like that but I did the lemon I still have to figure out what I'm gonna do with her nail I messed up a little bit right there. I'm gonna redo the grass because I realized I fucked it up. And then right here, because I didn't know what to do with this little corner, I'm gonna put a vendor selling cotton candy. So, that's where we're at right now. I'm gonna chip away at it a little more. Hopefully this video is enjoyable to watch. I feel like the more days that I'm working on it, and I'm not trying to speed it up crazy fast, it might be a few minutes long, so if you're watching this, I appreciate you. Thank you. You're an angel. I love you. Hug me. Then I came on in and put some cotton candy for a vendor. The nail. I did the Virgin Mary on that. And some more people in the stand. That turned out really good, in my opinion. And then I redid the grass because the grass kind of has some stripes on it. Added a bracelet, some tattoos, and that's it. Voila, that was my painting.